I worry about what's gonna happen with my culture if more people is coming. So now nobody likes to eat nakatamal, nobody wants to eat mondongo, nobody wants to eat like our own stuff. So nobody is celebrating that we saw this. They prefer to have Halloween. <laughs> they just um, told the people that they were given a huge amount for the construction of the canal, but you don't know where the money comes from. And I don't know, that creates like a lot of uncertainty. Moreover, I believe that that's a political strategy from the government. How do you think you can have the canal and allow those opportunities that you look forward to and preserve your culture? Being conscient about what we have, educating people. So if we're educating the Nicaraguan people that what we have, nobody else have it. We are unique, we are different, we are special. It doesn't matter how poor we are. We have a tissue in our own country, in our own culture, and we learn to um, appreciate what we have. And we don't have to change it. We can share it, but no change it. I think Nicaragua will be a country that will advance better. The constitutional reforms of this year, which change the whole political system. It gives indefinite re-election to the president, which like barely happens in the world. I think only Venezuela accepts that. Hoy, 22 de diciembre, Nicaragua empieza este gran megaproyecto. Viva Nicaragua libre! Viva el frente sandinista! Viva la juventud sandinista! Viva la niñez nicaragüense! I hope we're gonna be lucky as Panama and having uh, money because if you're traveling uh, into the deep of the country you will see how poor people is living, how miserable people is living and as I told you before so we think that most of the benefits are gonna go for the Sandinista government and also for the Chinese country. And we're gonna be just the workers. We're gonna be just the laborers. But at least we're gonna have money to survive every day. What is what we are doing now? That maybe through the canal, it's gonna be like easier to get a job. Maybe uh, the woman, they have to stop to go into the street and they can learn how to uh, get money for the family in a different way. Maybe the children gonna learn like they have to keep being educated to survive and to work in a different way. So maybe that change our perspective. At least I want to do it for my daughter. And yeah, so I hope the best for, for us. And don't lose what we have in the process.